In ages long past, it was believed that Mother Dana was indestructible and everlasting. Rena, on the other hand, was thought to be the domain of the gods, a paradise where the souls of the departed could rest forevermore. Oh, how wrong we were. In the face of Rena's unimaginable technology, its soldiers clad in huge, shining armor, and its fearsome beasts known as Zoogles, the prosperity and bounty of Dana all but disappeared overnight. That was 300 years ago. The world of Dana fell under Renin rule, and its new masters split the land into five distinct realms. And now today, Orbis Calaglia, one of the Renin's five realms. It is ruled over by the tyrant Balsef, Lord of the Firemaster Corps. Unrelenting fire scorches this barren wasteland. Dust storms course over the rocks and crags, and no relief is to be found from the oppressive heat. The Danon people toil as slaves. Day after day they suffer, under the ruthless oppression of the Renin soldiers, with only one hope of escape. Death. Only in death is their agony finally brought to an end. They have forgotten what it means to be free. So complete is the Renin's domination. Oh god. Safe and sorry, I suppose. Hello and welcome to my new Let's Play. I'm Ishin, and as you can see, we're playing Tales of Arise. Yeah, my second Tales of game that I'm playing, I think. Yeah, I'm very excited to play this game, and after this dramatic introduction, we are left with this mysterious person in an iron mask. Are you serious, dude? It's so hot here. 
in a scorched barren land and you have an iron mask on. What the heck? But okay. Your name was Kohl? That's cabbage in German. I'm so sorry, Iron Mask. You got hurt because of me. Don't sweat it, kid. It's not like I felt anything. But that's why Doc tells you to be extra careful, doesn't he? Yeah, but at the end of the day, I chose to stick my neck out for you, and I don't regret a thing, so don't sweat it, Koa, okay? Okay, thanks, Iron Mask. Okay, interesting new information. We can't feel anything. Like, I mean... We can't feel pain or something? That's kinda suicidal, but okay. Look at you! Hey, no loitering, embedded! Embedded? I thought they were referring to the... I don't know what that is, the... Inside his hand? Like on the back of his hand, there's a... Like a pearl or something? I thought they meant... Um, that by calling him embedded, but if I look at... Our protagonist. We do not have an embedded pearl on the back of our hand, but they still call us embedded. Okay, why is this lagging? Hold on. Okay, not sure what's wrong, but I hope it won't lag again. Okay, we can't go that way. We're gonna go to the doctor to patch us up. Oh my goodness. Are you okay? Hey, he's. He's also got a pearl on the back of his hand. Is it just me that is not embedded? But okay. Oh my god. I doubt Doc's gonna like what he sees. Yeah, alright. Oh no, I can't move the camera. Okay, no. He's got something. Hello? I need to have Doc check me out first. Yeah, sure. Let's talk about the intro. That was interesting. So, it seems like the people on this planet worship the worship the other planet as gods, but the other planet kind of attacked us, something like that, and made us their slaves. Wonderful. Yeah, 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 all right, all right. My god, it must be scorching hot here. How can you wear such a big armor like that? Like, big, thick, and iron armor like that? Isn't it, like, a little bit too hot? Uh, you're the doctor? Hello. Ah, you again. Sorry to trouble you, Doc. Do I have a name? Hmm. Look after yourself and there'd be no need for sorries, would there? Now sit. So, still unable to remember anything, I take it? Blank as always. Nothing but that strange dream. No face, no memories. Unable to feel pain, yet only too eager to take on everybody else's. What will we do with you? Here, let me see. No face. You may not be able to feel pain, but that doesn't mean you can't be wounded just like everyone else. If you're not more careful, you'll wind up dead without even realizing it one of these days. That's true. I watched another slave die today. More corpses than I care to count. Unfortunately, that's hardly a rare sight around these parts. Danans are always dying. And the Renans just watch. How long can this continue? Why doesn't anyone stand and fight? Keep your voice down, will you? <sighs> if only it were so simple, my friend. There have certainly been uprisings, all right. Three centuries worth of the damn things. As for all the good they've done, take a look around and judge for yourself. <sighs> there. 
That should just about do it. Now, do me a favor and try to stay out of trouble so the wound doesn't open again. Doc, back when I knew nothing, you were the one who taught me just how things work around here. You know I'll always be grateful for that, but I can't just... The race is won by the calm and the steady. You're still young, and you have time. Wait for the right moment, both for yourself and the world. Work will be wrapping up for the day soon enough. Don't sit around here. Go out and feel the breeze against your skin. Even a slave's entitled to that. Just do me a favor and keep a low profile, all right? You stand out enough in that mask as it is. <laughs> yeah, no one's questioning me. So I can't get off the Guess mask? I'll go back to my room. Or what? Like the doctor also has a pearl. Oh, I can run now. Pearl on the back of his left hand. Like everyone, like every slave I've met so far. Hi, Cole. Are you okay? Thanks for seeing me earlier. It's all right. Wow. Oh, hello. Okay, fine. Um, wow, the camera sensitivity is a little bit too much, I think. Let me, let me check that. Um, not here. Or here. Um, can I... No, do not invert that. <laughs> camera speed, yeah, field. Oops, I didn't save, didn't I? Okay, save and go back. Yes. Okay, now it's much better. Hello. He's got one on his hand. He's got one. The bright eyes stick these weird stones on our bodies and then work us to the bone until we're dead. The weird stones. Do you refer to the thing on the back of your hand? And is it a routine beating from them weren't enough? When they're in a really bad mood, they like to stick their zugles on us. Those dragons that we saw in the intro. I'm a slave, just like everyone else here. So how come I don't have a spirit core? A spirit face, core? Memories for that matter. I like worrying about it, it'll change anything. Wait, do you mean the thing on the back of his head? What's a spirit core? Hello, I can talk to you. What are you looking at? You looking to get your ass kicked too? No, 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 no. I have to keep a low profile. Like, I'm so suspicious. I have this iron mask. Isn't this illegal or something? They're not moving. They're dead. Damn it. Oh, toggle run dash. Interesting. Jump! I can jump. Location map. Okay, my bad is in the back of the camp. What's this green thing left to me? Oh, hello. Do you have something? Oh, look at that, a dog. Is this a Zugo or something else? Every last one of your embedders will die, and then we can do whatever we want with you. Now burn. I mean... Do you not want slaves? Is there... I mean, is there any purpose to us dying? Oh! Hello, can I pet you? No? <laughs> I guess not. 
Get to bed and better now. Okay, fine. Fine. <sighs> no matter how tired you get of seeing them, you can always find Rena and Lenegis hanging up in the sky. I hate it. It's like they're watching over us, keeping an eye on our every move. That Lenegis especially is something else. There's no way we can ever hope to beat the Renans where they can build floating castles like that. Okay, yeah, Renan is the planet and Lenegis is a floating castle. I don't see it yet unless it's that weird sphere. Okay, okay. What's the green marker? Is it... Is it just that I can talk to him? Did I give permission? Give you permission to walk off the job embedded? I don't think so. Ever wonder what those bright eyes like to burn all over the place? I'll tell you, it's the fuel they make us mine for. There's no reason for us to do it. Once we do, they just take it and light it up. And that's why it's hotter than hell here. Okay, we're mining stuff, but it doesn't do anything, according to this man. Hold on, there's an exclamation mark here. Why? Why is there an exclamation mark here? So there's no point to us um, mining here, huh? That's why they just want to... That's why that other guy was so happy to burn us. Okay. Hello. Listen, whatever the bastards do to you, don't even think about trying to fight back against them bright eyes, got it? I know, I know. Not like any of us have any chance in hell of ever beating one of those soldiers of or the Zoogles, let alone Lord Balsef. Shh, don't talk about this in public, you two. Who knows what they'll do if you if they hear you guys. Why is there an exclamation mark on on that dialogue as well? Okay, he's done. Done for today. I am quite confused. I can details. Important NPC, okay? That's why they're important. Hold on. But I don't even know their name. Fine. Ooh, that is a Zugo. Okay. Terrifying. All right. I should get some rest. Okay, okay. I can't do anything else, it seems. Hello, neighbor. Can't it wait, Iron Mask? I'm trying to catch a little shut eye over here. Okay, okay. I think that's. Um, the signal to get to sleep as well. I wonder how many people have slept in this bed before me. Mine for now, but for how long? Till you're Tomorrow's dead. another day. I guess I should get some shut eye. I guess. Oh wow! What cheerful music! <laughs> I better head to work. So I've got business with the freight train today, huh? Great. Hello, are you my neighbor? What are you doing? You better go to your assigned position before the bright eyes beat you. Okay. So the Renans have bright eyes. Reminds me of Stormlight Archive. <laughs> Great. Time to start another day toiling away for the Renans. Am I gonna do this until the day I die? 
Yep, that's our goal here. The freight train. Oh, I can't go this way. And the doctor, the doctor. How are you injuries? Don't get up to anything too reckless out there, alright? I promise I'll behave myself. What are we supposed to do? Look lively, slaves! Let's see some work around here! These are huge trains. Resistance Grenar. <laughs> Zephyr, she's here. Who? Who's that? Okay. The girl's nowhere to be found. Uh, this hurts. Hey, Impenage, did you find anything? Not yet, sir. What do they expect from us on such short notice? <laughs> Whoa, she's alive. Hey, you're... <laughs> He's got high heels. <laughs> Over there! Don't move! Go now! Huh? Hurry, get moving! <clears throat> Stay still! You cost us a lot of trouble, you know. Now we can do this the easy way, or not. <laughs> We're escaping! It's just you. I hope the lady is worth it! Oh boy. Armored soldiers! Are we gonna fight with that? Well, wow, we are acrobatic.
Impressive. Don't touch the girl. <laughs> The Renans don't know that they can't touch the girl? Uh -huh. Oh. You all missed your chance to become Lord. Which means you lot live and die for me, the mighty Balsaf! Got that through your skulls? Now hurry up and bring me Shion! Shion? Yes, hmm. Even the drinks lost its appeal. Someone's in a bad mood. Lord Wolsey, ruler of Orbis Calaglia. Ah, but it's wild beast you prefer, isn't it? Do forgive me. Ganabelt Valkyris, what do you want? From what I hear, you seem to be having some trouble over there in Calaglia. As a fellow lord, I merely thought to ask whether I could be of any assistance to you. Enough with the false pretense. I can tell a rat when it's sniffing around. Forgive me, I can only imagine the emotional toll failing to ascend the throne not once but twice must take. A most distressing state of affairs. Shut up! It's none of your concern. The crown contest is proceeding apace, and so quickly, I must say. It won't be long before the victor is crowned as the new sovereign. I look forward to it, and you can be sure I won't forget our little chat. Nor will I. Until next time. Okay, some sort of Renan political unrest. Uh, uh. Alfen. Oh, that was a dream. Where? You awake? Who are you? The name's Tilsa. I'm the medical officer for the Crimson Crows. You're in one of our safe houses. The Crimson Resistance. Crows? Don't tell me you've never heard of us. We're the Resistance, for the Danon people. We get in the way of the Bright Eyes' best laid plans. The Danon Resistance? I didn't know such a thing existed. Oh, we exist all right. Though I guess we're not as famous as I thought we were. Seems like I know more about you than the other way around, Mr. Iron Mask. Is it true you can't take that thing off? Yeah. Worse is that I don't even know why I'm wearing it. Why do you know me? That woman I was with. Oh, yeah. She's quite the character, isn't she? Zephyr should be interrogating her over in the slammer as we speak. You locked her up? Why? Why? Go take a look for yourself if you're so interested. Is she Renan? They're interrogating her? Just what the hell is going on? I mean, I need to go and find out for myself. The Danans and the Renans don't look too different, like appearance-wise. Hello. This here is a service line for the old abandoned mines. There are so many of these lines all over the place. It enables us to be nimble and stay one step ahead of the bright eyes. So you're using the trains as well if you want to know something I'll tell you what you what I can oh thank you what is this place I know that already I know that who's Zephyr Zephyr is the Crimson Crows leader 
He's not just physically strong, he's got real smarts. He's indispensable to us. If you want to know something... Yeah, okay. Who are you fighting? Who else? The remnants ruling over Calaglia. The ones that came down from lineages have been giving us hell for the last three centuries. Of course, we can't even reach neighboring towns, much less lineages. So our current target is the remnants in Calaglia and their lord Balsef. Okay. I told you, we are a resistance group fighting the Bright Eyes. Our goal is to liberate Calaglia. So injuries are a constant thing for us. It's distressing work for me as a medic. This is the old Zion Mine, one of the Crimson Crow's safe houses. Abandoned mines like this one are pretty commonplace, so we have no shortage of places to hide out. If you want to know something, okay. Good, okay, alright. What's your name again? <laughs> What's your name? Tilza, okay. Thank you, Tilza. Oh. Well, if it isn't Iron Mask himself, good to see you, buddy. Buddy, do I know you? Have we met before? Nah, we've never met before, but you're definitely famous in these parts. Everyone knows you as the Buckethead who stands up to the armored soldiers and can take a beating from them like it's nothing at all. Guys like you don't come around that often at all. It would be weird if we didn't know about you somehow. Oh god, I don't even know about myself. I'm a resistance fighter as well? No wonder. Hello. Try not to wander around too much. Alright. The only reason the Bright Eyes want to mine through Calaglia so much is so they can get as much fire out of this realm as they possibly can. Why? Why do they need the fire? And how do you get fire out of this realm? Maybe via some natural resource that has that has been depleted on Renan? So they need to come down here? Hey, I noticed you don't have a spirit core on your body. Did you dig it out yourself? You did real you did really good not having any of the bright eyes catch you without one all this time. I'm impressed. I guess the spirit core is the thing on the back of my head, on the back of the heads of all the slaves. So... Yeah, it's a symbol of slavery, I guess, that I'm a slave, maybe? A spirit core, but why the name spirit core? It needs to have some other function, right? Oh. Ah, damn it! So it wasn't a lie. The slightest touch is like being struck by lightning. What are you doing? So you're finally awake, huh? What's going on here? What did she ever... Mind your business. <laughs> so even if you don't mean to hurt somebody, if they touch you, they get electrocuted, huh? It doesn't seem to be poison or magic. Is this the reason Balsef's soldiers were after you? Can she speak? For the last several days, Balsef's forces have been getting pretty restless. When we looked into it deeper, the word thorns came up over and over again. And now, we come across Miss Prickly herself. Hmm. Drop the attitude. Did you really think we wouldn't find out anything about you? Miss Shion Imeris. <laughs> That's her name? You mean she's... What? You didn't figure it out already? Yeah, that's right. This lady's got herself a surname. Which means one thing. She's a Renan, our enemy. Yeah, but she was being chased by Renan soldiers. So then why? That's exactly what we're trying to figure out. After all, aside from the clothes they wear, there's only one way to tell a Danit from and that's whether their eyes light up or not. Light up? Right, bright eyes. Big talk for someone who can't even use astral arts. Embedded. 
Don't you call us embedded. Look, you see the stone your people embedded in me? There isn't one, because we gouged them out the day we swore to rise up against your kind. This scar's a reminder not to rest until every last Faith. one of you is... He's got bright eyes, we right? We Danans may not be capable of using astral arts, but it looks like those thorns of yours won't do you much good in escaping here either. Still, inflicting pain on anyone who comes near you, that's one hell of an ability. You're wrong. You think this curse is some kind of great ability? No! <laughs> Fair enough. All I know is Balsef must have his eye on you for a damn good reason. And until we find out why... <laughs> An ambush! They must have tracked us down. Evacuate his plant. Hurry! And bring the girl. If she gives you any trouble, wave a spear in her face. I got it. Hey, Iron Mask! Sorry, but right now it's everyone for themselves. What about you? I'm going to welcome our guests. Don't go dying on me. Come on, move. And don't try anything funny. I think we can handle ourselves. Wait, uh, how did you guys even manage to handcuff her in the first place? When you can't even touch her. Dull sword, a rusted long sword. Okay, in need of repair. Fighting with it is more like using a blunt weapon rather than a bladed one. Wait, I can... Enemy attack! Okay, escape from the mines. Um, oh yeah. Press escape to open the menu or save. This game will also automatically save. Oh, thank you. Thank you for automatic saving. I'm gonna save anyway. Just in case. Um, what about my equipment? Dull sword. Ragged clothes. Accessory none. Clothing that's long since worn out after the years of hard labor. Nobody remembers how it even looked when it was still new. Oh, I can change posts. Uh, okay, I think I don't think we have time to do that right now. Renans are here. I have to find an exit and get the hell out of here. If the Bright Eyes arrest you and try to make you rat anyone out, you have two options. Either break out or find a way to keep quiet. Permanently. Jeez, thanks for the vote of confidence. Damn it, what the hell are the lookouts doing? How did Balsaf's men ever find this place? It's Zugo! Can't get out this way, you have to hurry and find another exit. Okay. Presumably they are coming this way. Anyone who can fight, grab a weapon! Damn! How did they find out about this place? Oh wow. Many dead. Leave everything in essential behind. We'll make do without one way or another if we make it out alive. Are you okay? Damn it, if it wasn't for that armor the bright eyes wear, I could totally take them one by one. One on one. They're just ordinary arenas underneath. There's nothing else that's special about them. But all the machinery in their armor makes them way bigger and stronger than they otherwise would. I hate it. Those guys play dirty. High tech, huh? High tech armor? Have these kinds of battles been going on this entire time? I just didn't know. Damn it, that bright-eyed woman took advantage of all the confusion and broke out. Oh no! Okay. Um, can I not help? <laughs> Just standing there. Not doing anything. Is this no way to go? Fine. Oh! It's no use trying to take on the armored soldiers like this. It'll only mean more casualties for us to deal with later. Okay, good to know. Avoid. Avoid instead of... Um, oh. Yeah, speaking of avoid, I don't think I can avoid this one. Stop right there! 
Oh, it's just that Danon. You there! Where's the Renan girl who was here? Well, I... Have... <laughs> I want an answer, insurgent! I guess I'll tell Pass you. For an answer. Go to hell! <laughs> you dare address a Renan armored soldier that way? I'll show you in Benin! Don't you realize I don't have a spirit core? Press Q to perform a normal attack. Okay, that's weird already. At first you can string up to three normal attacks together, but by learning certain skills this limit can be increased. Characters can also attack in midair after jumping. Okay. Arts are special actions performed by spending part of your arts gauge. Press R, E, or F to use the art assigned to each key. One EG will gradually restore automatically. It will restore more slowly when attacking. Hmm. Evading. Push and press shift to evade an enemy attack. If you time it well as an enemy attack is approaching, you'll perform a perfect evasion, allowing you to avoid taking any damage, okay? Why is Q a normal attack? That is so weird, but okay. Uh, R E F. <laughs> okay, okay. It's also weird. Conquer die. So much for playing nice. Ouch. A real fight. Still, I have to do this. Oh God. Oh god. What is it doing? Oh. Oh wow, okay. Oh, I can use the camera. Ouch, oh my god, okay. Oh, I can ha I can do arts. Okay. Where's my art gauge? Oh, I can attack with uh, my mouse. Here I come. It's over. Take this. Where's my HP gauge? <laughs> I won. I actually beat one of those Renan soldiers. Um. I've got to keep going. I have to survive this no matter what. Didn't the girl say only Renans can use arts? Or am I missing something? Hold on, hold on. How much health do I have? Can I find that out? I didn't see any HP gauge. And I don't know where my art gauge is either. Um, okay, that's it. What's here? Really? There's nothing here? I'm so disappointed. Oh, I can hold shift to run as well, to sprint. Okay. That's a prison where the girl was, right? Oh, something here. Apple gel. What's this thing? Don't try to take on any armored soldiers yourself. You don't have any chance in. You don't have a chance in hell of winning. Suspicious. Seems like somehow we're different from all those Danians, huh? Like we're Renan, maybe. Hello. No choice. Now you learn. Here I come. Oh god. Ouch. Break! How can I switch targets? Okay, push AD as you hold Alt to change your current target. Ouch. 
Ouch! <laughs> Where's my HP gauge? Nice, perfect dodge. Was that a perfect dodge? Oh god. Where's my HP gauge? Where's my arts gauge? Ouch. Okay, that was kind of bad. <laughs> If I say so myself, um, honestly, do I not have an HP gauge or an art gauge? I'm so confused. Or is this just a tutorial? Are you okay? I thought the woman was completely unarmed. How the hell did she get a weapon? Not that I'm complaining, it saved my ass, that's what I'm sure. Oh, she saved you. Oh, there she is! Xion be mayor, I merit Daymore. I hereby detain you in the name of His Excellency Lord Balsam. Damn it! Throw down I was your so weapon. close. Close to escaping. <laughs> what the? the? You got some kind of death wish? Those are armored soldiers here. Shut up and get out of here while you still can! Step aside, slave. These are Renan affairs you're meddling in. Hey! We've got a better chance working together. Besides, I don't much feel like being indebted to a Danon. <laughs> Fine, suit yourself. How do you know I'm a Danon? Okay, combos. Combos are actions strung together with no gaps. Normal attacks have a set limit. While arts can continue until AG runs out. Normal attacks count separately on the ground and in the air. Using an R to go between them can thus extend the combo. What? So I want to... No, what? <laughs> so I want to use normal attacks and then an R and another... Normal attack in the air, is that it? I don't know, I don't get it. Um, diminishing returns in combos. During a combo, if the same art is used multiple times within four actions, its penetration will decrease and enemies will recover from it sooner. Continually doing so will raise the penalties, making arts half as effective at their harshest. Okay, that is not good, so I need to change up the arts as well. Hmm. Ouch. What the heck? Ouch. I didn't dodge. Okay. Why did you help me? What could a Danon like you possibly gain from helping a Renan like me? Trust me, I've no great love for Renans. I guess I'm just not as consumed with hatred as some. What? Have we met somewhere before? Me? Friends with a Danon? Can't say I've had the pleasure. Well, when you put it like that, yeah, silly question. I don't remember anything about my past. I don't have any clues to go on either. Not even my own face. Let me get this straight. You don't know what you look like, but you thought I might somehow recognize you? <laughs> Something like that. Guess my helping you back there wasn't as self-sacrificing as I made it out to be. Besides, I can't feel pain anyway, so it's not like... Wait. 
You really can't feel pain? Uh, yeah. It's just another thing I don't have. No pain, no face, no memories. I only know one thing about myself, and that's that I'm a slave. What about your name? You must have one, right? Iron Mask. Got the name from the person who found me. Said that this way, I wouldn't forget I had a real name out there somewhere. I see. So where to next? Outside, silly. What do you think we fought all this way for? Okay, she evaded my question. Stay sharp. We're going in. Um, yeah, okay. She on? <laughs> Where is she on? Wait, I didn't read it. Can you even see out of that thing? Like, at all? Of course I can. How else do you think I managed to avoid tripping everywhere I go? What is that thing anyway? It doesn't look like anything Dan and I've ever seen. Beats me. I don't remember anything about my past. When I came to, I was already wearing it. If I could get it off, I would. Damn thing makes it hard to eat. I can't scratch my face when it itches. It's the worst. Honestly, I'm just impressed you've managed to survive this long looking like that. I'm sure you attract attention wherever you go. Most of the other Danans don't pay it any mind. It's in everyone's best interest to just keep their heads down, focus on their work, and pretend they don't notice. What about the Renan soldiers? Didn't they notice? Yeah, what the about guards? them? They're more the kill first, ask questions later type. Be in the wrong place or step out of line and you're dead. Mask or no mask. That said, as long as you keep your head down and don't cause trouble, they mostly ignore you. Honestly, sometimes they don't look all that keen to stir up trouble themselves. A friend of mine said it's because if they kill us without a good reason, it could delay the work and put them behind schedule. At that point, it'd be their necks on the line. You should know more about all that than me, though, right? I don't serve any of the lords. But I see what you mean. After three centuries of run and rule without much upheaval, it's possible the soldiers might be losing their edge. All this trouble we've caused might be the first excitement they've had in a while. Well, I don't plan on getting killed for their amusement. Okay, uh, to be honest, I don't really like the new dialogue system. I like the old 2D animated ones. They were fun. Okay. Oh, you're already here. Glad to see you made it. I heard you managed to escape, but I didn't expect to see old Iron Mask with you. In any case, we're all wanted by the Renans. It'll be easier for everyone if you both just come with me. Not? She nodded. Where are the others? They're waiting for us up ahead. Come on. Oh. Stay where you are, dissidents. Just look at all these soldiers. How badly did they want to destroy this hideout? She Apprehend the traitor! Slaughter the rest! Oh! Look out! <laughs> What the? Sion! <laughs> Holy crap. Sion! But how? <gasps> Impossible. The Master Core. He was embedded within her all along. No matter. Kill her if you have to. Just retrieve the core. 
Wow, okay. I'm so confused. So confused right now. The Master Core. You okay? Your arms! Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. How about that? Guess it's just as well I can't feel it, huh? You're not in agony? Wait, are you serious? Hold still. Huh? Oh, her eyes glow up when she it's uses one of arts. My healing arts. A sword that sears the hand of he who wields it, and a healing art to mend. A man numb to pain, and a woman whose very touch deals nothing but. Thank you. <sighs> All right. Let's rout the bastards and finish them off before the surviving stragglers have a chance to regroup. Iron Mask, you coming? Definitely. I'm not about to go back all that way alone. So I guess you're not planning on releasing me, huh? Sorry. You're coming with us. In that case, there's one thing you should know. No one uses that flaming sword without my say-so. You needn't worry on that score. I doubt many of us could get close to it in the first place. Or would want to. The blazing sword. It just might be strong enough to match the power of a lord. No, maybe even to surpass it. Are you sure you're okay? Uh, what do you mean? Your wound. That soldier nailed you pretty good. Not to mention those flames bursting from you. They only hit my master core, so I'll be fine. And the flames weren't even hot. It's probably because they're just a manifestation of the astral energy. Honestly, I'm more surprised that you really are incapable of feeling pain. Did you think I was faking? No, I believed you. I guess seeing you stay calm while bearing those burns to your hands just really made it hit home for me. It's ironic. I have no problem hurting anyone who touches me. But as soon as I try to wield that sword, it's me who gets hurt. Do you wish you were impervious to pain too? You realize you could burn your fingers off without even noticing, right? So what? All I need right now is power. And up until now, I haven't come across anything stronger than that blazing sword the whole time I've been doing this. You really don't care what happens to you as long as you get what you're after, do you? Don't talk like you know me. Uh. <sighs> you... <sighs> you're right. I don't get you. I don't get why you're so quick to throw it all away. Not when us slaves have never had a choice in whether we lived or died. <sighs> you befriended Xion! Uh, I'm not sure we could call her friends just yet. Sifia has teamed up with your party. Am I friends with Sifia? <laughs> Xion's fighting style. Shion specializes in gun-based, long-range strikes and astral arts. Use her to hit enemies from a safe distance and to use healing arts on allies with low HP. Healing arts cost CP to use, so mind your CP total. When auto mode is enabled, Shion will primarily target flying and astral art-wielding enemies, as well as foes with lower HP during combat. CV Cure Points, okay. Arts with healing and support effects consume Cure Points in addition to HE. 
CP is shared across the party and can be restored with items or by staying at an inn or a campground. It can be raised by leveling up or finding specific items. Alright, 